as the election season approaches peace agreement partners have expressed concerns over unresolved issues crucial for conducting credible elections at the end of the transitional period to addressing these challenges Vice President Osin Abdelbagia Kol convened with the Troika ambassadors to addressing obstacles in the peace implementation process. In a media statement following the discussions, U.S. Ambassador Adela emphasizes the necessity for political parties to engaging in dialogue to resolve their differences, steering the nation towards social and political tranquility. We reaffirmed that our priority in South Sudan is peace and that peace can be best secured through genuine and peaceful elections. The South Sudanese people desire and should have. We also talked about the urgent need for dialogue, inter-party dialogue among this country's leaders. In other news, Vice President Osin Abdelbagi Kol and United Nations Mission in South Sudan, Honimis, Chief Nicholas Haisam have held discussions to addressing the challenges facing interpolitical party dialogue and civic space ahead of the upcoming national general elections in December 2024. At this stage of the political process, uh, including the economic uh, and financial challenges. South Sudan really needs the political stakeholders, the political parties, to come together to agree on a way forward. And that, more than anything else, would provide relief and certainty to the people of South Sudan. We, for our part, stand ready to help, but these are decisions which must be made by South Sudanese. Echoing these sentiments, Ayaga Garang, Executive Director in the Office of the Vice President and escort the Vice President's unwavering commitment to addressing the outstanding issues in the Peace Accord. His Excellency the Vice President assured you that the country leadership is working around the clock to address uh, these challenges. UN is a partner and a stakeholder in South Sudan peace process and all uh, the development aspect. And uh, when uh, such concerns are brought to attention of the leadership, of course, the leadership is feeling them. And uh, there are daily uh, efforts being exerted to ensure that these challenges are overcome and a country put on the right trajectory. These discussions underscore the unwavering dedication of the peace partners to addressing the existing shortcomings within the peace process facilitating the country's transition to enduring peace and stability. Reporting for SSBC News, Mathiang Joseph, Juba.